It sounds like Cameron Monaghan wants to jump into Star Wars live action as his character, Cal Kestis. Cameron Monaghan was recently at a fan expo where he explained what he would deem necessary for his character to make the jump into a live action series, movie, etc. When asked about his character joining the Star Wars live action universe in a TV show, Cameron had the following to say, quote, it would have to be right. By that, I mean it has to continue the story or the character in some way. I don't want him to just kind of stand. I don't want him to kind of just show up and stand around and be there. I want him to mean something and for there to be a significance for the character itself. So, it would have to make sense. But in the right context, then yeah, absolutely. End quote. Now that is what Cameron Monaghan himself said, the actor who does the mocap and who the Cal Kestis character look is based off of. In my opinion, he is a very great actor and I would love to see him in a Star Wars live action project. And I think it's very cool that he sees himself in a role like that as well. And hopefully it happens someday. Now there is one issue with this. I think this needs to happen after the end of the Jedi games because we have to see what they want with his character in those. Does he die? Does he live? How would it make sense where his character fits in the greater overarching story of the Star Wars live action universe? We need those questions answered first before we can see him just jump into a live action because it could potentially spoil the game's trilogy ending or make it a big mess for the developers and storytellers of that game to figure out how they are going to tweak their third game to be in continuity with the live action canon. But once that game series ends, and if Monaghan is still open to it and available, I think this would be a great move. He has been a very well-received character, and say he survives his game series, I think we'd see him play a large role in the future of Star Wars. Now, whether he's on his own missions during the OT or just in the background, let's say he survives the OT and the sequel trilogy era, we could potentially see him find his way into this Mandoverse that we are seeing play out. Now, I know that sounds super crazy, but again, depending on how his trilogy ends, we could see him go into exile, just stay behind the scenes, and pop up at the right time, which could either be during this Thrawn era, or even in the Rey movie era. Again, I know that's crazy, but I don't know what else they could do with him at this point. He obviously wasn't present in the OT, he wasn't present in the sequels. Again, they could do standalone seasons with him where he's kind of just doing his own thing in the galaxy, but I feel like it needs to tie in in some way, especially with him being a survivor of Order 66. He's got to meet some big names along the way in his live action series, as he has in his game series. And of course, like the actor said himself, it needs to make sense. I'm going to relate this back to what Sam Jackson said recently about Mace Windu quote unquote not being dead and that he wants to star in a Disney Plus series. My opinion on that was very iffy. I think it would be cool, but again, it needs to make sense. Everything that Star Wars puts out needs to make sense. It needs to follow canon. It needs to fit in the timeline. The continuity needs to be there. And I unfortunately, I think we haven't seen a lot of that as of recently. So Cameron is very much in the right here, wanting that role and wanting to play a larger part in the Star Wars universe, but only at the cost of it making sense and pleasing fans. He doesn't want to just be there and be a cameo. He doesn't want to just stand in. He wants the character to do something for the greater overall universe which is very rightfully so, and I completely agree with him. But that is all the news we have on that. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Would you like to see Cameron Monaghan come into live action and play his character Cal Kestis? And where do you think he would fit into the timeline? I'm excited to hear what you guys have to say. On your way out, please make sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe to the channel if you're new. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.